Hey beautiful people, welcome or welcome back. I'm Josie with Awakened Soul, in case you're new here. We're here to get messages about your SP, whoever came to mind when this video found you and you had a calling to click on it. I'm gonna be pulling their current stance towards you, their thoughts, their feelings, any energies and intentions they have, and we'll get channeled messages as well. You guys, some of you, like you or your person are already in a committed relationship and they wanna change that. Just gonna be real with you, okay? Some of you guys, one of, one of you is already in a committed relationship and they wanna change that from what I can see here. Okay, let me get these cards organized for you. We have the Two of Pentacles coming out, Libra with Justice, Gemini with the Knight of Swords, the Eight of Swords, and then we have Pisces, the High Priestess. Yeah, so this person intuitively knows that there's a deep connection going on between the two of you. They might be seeing you in their dreams, or maybe you've confessed to them that you see them in, that they, that you see them in your dreams. Why can't I talk right now, you guys? Oh my goodness, sorry about that. But anyway, like, there's a deeper thing going on here. Your person acknowledges that, but one of you is restricted in another relationship. Now, if that isn't a romantic relationship, it could also be like a really toxic family dynamic or friendship, and your person is acknowledging that there's some type of barrier getting between the two of you that is blocking this connection from being able to move forward, okay? Um, something involving communication is really important in the near future to them as well, so they might want to actually have a conversation with you about this and try to figure out how you can rebalance the situation, eliminate those blockages, and move forward towards each other, but there's definitely some type of a blockage that has to get removed first. The reason I'm thinking that it might be a romantic relationship for some of you out there is because we have Libra with justice. So maybe one or both of you are in a marriage or a really long-term committed relationship, um, but it's like a loveless relationship, something that one of you is already thinking about exiting anyway. Okay. So it's not anything that's like, I guess, not expected by all parties, if that makes sense, right? Like this would be a long-term relationship that is already like run its course, basically, if that's the case. But for some of you, it might be more platonic. But essentially, there's some type of external party and situation that's blocking them from formally being able to come towards you and make a deep romantic offer. However, they are working on that. They're getting closer and they're brainstorming because there is a big change coming and they're aware of that. And it has something to do with the conversation between the two of you that needs to be had. So maybe you guys can work as a team to get over this obstacle together, basically. Let's get out a few messages from them now to see what they would have to say to you. What would this person say, please, spiritual team? What would this person have to say, please? Okay. Inseparable. Our love is always there despite the distance. So for some of you guys, it could just be like a long distance relationship and it's not an actual external party um, like a romantic partner or something getting between the two of you. It's just a great distance. Like one of you would have to move across state lines or countries or something like that in order to be with the other. And your person's aware of that, but they know that they can feel you even though there's a huge distance between the two of you, either literally or metaphorically, basically, okay? Missed opportunity, I didn't act when I should have. Maybe that's also the case. Um, it could be that maybe this was right person, wrong time energy. You guys have known each other for a while. And at one point in time in the past, you had an opportunity to be together without these extra obstacles. Um, but you just missed out on that opportunity. It's probably divinely timed to be that way anyway. And um, now things are different. It's more complicated if you guys want to be together. Indecisive. I know my inability to make a decision hurts you. Yeah, that could have been the past energy. Maybe this could have been deepened in the past between the two of you, but your person couldn't make up their mind until it was too late. And now you guys have cycled back around to each other again, but there are extra obstacles getting between the two of you. So I don't know if you feel like letting me know how it resonates down below. You're welcome to. Don't forget to like and subscribe if you haven't already. And I hope to see you for a future video. Bye for now.